Now let's place some doors and windows. To place door or window, uh, there are two buttons on the architecture tab. It's much easier to place them on the plan view. So I go to level 1 and then uh, I click on door and uh, now I start to place my doors. You can pick mm, a door in the properties bar. Now I have just M single flush door and different dimensions for it. So I select the biggest one and place it here or here. To place you need to uh, move your mouse over your wall and uh, moving your mouse from, out, from one to other side you can uh, define a place of your door, a side of your door. And with the space bar you can turn on you can um, set its position here and here alright uh, and uh, of course you can load new doors to your project you can do so uh, you can do this uh, two different ways while you are placing a door you can click load family and go to doors and uh, say thumbnails for example this one and this one open alright and now I can select any of these doors for example double door and uh, decorative door here. The second way to load your objects it's uh, go to, to the insert tab and uh, say load family. It's the same thing but uh, when you go to insert tab and say load family you can load any kind, any type of your family from any folder. Uh, and when you are placing your door and then you say load family uh, you can just add doors if you try to load for example Windows Revit says oh no it's not a door so I can't load it here it is so uh, if you know what type of door do you need I, uh, for me it's easier to go to insert tab and load uh, any my families and if you forget about uh, some kind, some family of a door, of course you can load it while you are placing your door. With Windows, the same thing. Window, hand pick or window from your types, or you can load window with load family or insert load family. Windows. For example, these ones. And uh, now I can pick any window. And uh, like in doors, depend of your position of a mouse, you can place uh, a window uh, in the outer side or in inner side of your wall. and here and uh, of course you can add your windows in a three dimensional view but uh, for me it's a little harder to place it correctly and uh, windows has a uh, window has two parameters uh, seal high and head high and uh, you can enter this parameter as you want. It's a uh, high of your um, lowest part of your window. So here it is, two windows with different parameters still high. And now 
let's see Ah, sorry, it's the same one, uh, and uh, here it is. Uh, after you placed a window or door, you can work with its parameters in properties. Uh, in the advanced training, I'll show you how you can work with your families, how you cre create your type of object and load it into your model.